Z another Xanadu classic. <laughs> Wait, so is N New Jersey and Philly all out? Yeah, so that was uh, that was for that was for fourth place. That was um, that was maybe at fourth. Uh, me and Stango, I believe, at five five. And we got we got she did ball dittos. What? Bob did it? Ball to the ball to the tank. They're both, they're both playing right now. I don't really know why. I also can't even tell if they're playing right now because they're both like not hitting each other in a way that I can't tell. It's like, like, like they're just not hitting each other. Yeah. All right, they're hitting each other. They, maybe they play each other so much that they have to go for the most obscure, suboptimal tactics. The, like, the what reads is that? on like, the reads. Yeah. So oh reads in another God. dimension. Standard get up. Chain grab? Uh, maybe too high to chain grab. Or tilt a weird choice. Not if you're half first playing. Yo! Wait, I missed. I turned I turned away the last second. That was, that was pretty nice. Yeah, the shield drops. Yeah, what happened was, Pat was, um, Plank was doing a Shino saw on the ledge, but he didn't do it properly. Oh. And Hat seized the opportunity to get chain grab the next stock. Yeah, okay. But uh, thanks for coming out, guys. Nice to see. Wait, did you guys get your prize money? You got fifth, right? I'm pretty sure you get money for fifth. Go, go harass, go harass uh, Apostle in the back. Jersey about to, or Stango, uh, huh? whatever. They, they about to leave without getting their prize money. I was uh, like, no, 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 come back. Yeah. <laughs> that you, you fat prize money. Well, didn't they win in teams? Well, he, he got fifth, though. I think they already got their team's money, but uh, fifth, I'm pretty sure, gets something. Dang. So, let's see. If he doesn't, I'm, I'm, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did, didn't Stango go by a different tag before? I have no idea. I feel like. I, I've seen him before, and I, when I've seen him, he definitely didn't have this tag Stango. Uh, I wish I could see the chat, because I'm sure somebody knows. Also, for whatever reason, Probably no one's watching. I swore he was a peach mate. <laughs> like, what made you think that? I have no idea. Stango doesn't sound like a peach. And I, when I hear Stango, I think Marth, like, slicing and dicing. <laughs> Alright, what kind of... <laughs> Stan, I mean, Stan Go, like Stan Go, Stan, stay in place would be like Peach. Oh my god. It is, it is too high level. I know. You had a hard, hard read the, the, the name, the bracket name. Mm, 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 mm. Hatch should have just kept the eye out. Ooh. Juicy. Alright, alright, I lied. So I, the reason I think that was wrong was because if you're getting chain grab, I think the best way to get out of it is you just DI off, right? You, you DI off, you off take the their 50-50 of like their, like Pete, or sorry, Sheik at this point gets like run off bear, right? And you yeah. take that edge guard. Yeah. Or like you're getting chain grabbed on FD as Pikachu, or against Pikachu as Fox, you just DI off the stage. Yeah. Like, because if you don't DI off the stage, they just chain grab you some more. Right. <laughs> I mean, I guess you, if you're hoping that they're going to... It's like up. it's like you hope they mess up, but like hoping your opponent messes up is almost never the way to go. It's yeah, like not, not against someone who's like really, really, really good. Sheep. Like all you have to do is just press the Z button over and over. Yeah, it's very hard to mess up. Although I got told because I think Plank messed it up. Like Plank messes up again. Whatever. I think might have been ending already. Yeah. yeah. What a weird. Yeah, it was a weird. Uh, not standard. a forward air. Down throw, he's gonna get onto the platform. Mm. Grabs him again, DI to the platform. No, oh. Definitely. Dude, definitely sub a bit of stuff third. right here. <laughs> Didn't drink his DJ. That might be, oh. <laughs> and that's it. No, DI. <laughs> but yeah, like, I've seen Space Animals in Pikachu matchup against Axe. Mm. Not DI at the stage on FD, and it's like. It's like that character has a zero to one hundred to an up smash KO on you. Yeah. At least if he's trying to edge guard you, you can maybe live, right? Right. Oh my gosh, he almost died. Well, I don't know how tight the the timing is on, on Pikachu. Pikachu. It's so easy. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> it's Shots so fired easy. At no, it's just it's just like uh, some chain grabs are harder than others, right? Yeah. That's true. Like uh like the fox on fox mm. chain grab. 
that stops at around like some percent, and you have to like do weird DIs and up tilts, right? Right. Pikachu, you just you just up 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 throw them, and then even at zero, it's like the easiest. It's like super easy to 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 grab into you, right? Right. So it's like you're you're not gonna trick them. You're not gonna make the mess. Oh my god. The that dodge some, behind to up throw. some Dreffin on Dreffin stuff right there. She'll drop up air. What's it gonna be? It's crazy seeing these guys chill drop now. I remember when it was just like, I don't know, like you and me in MD <laughs> chill dropping. Oh, yeah. It was us too, wasn't it? Yeah, pretty much. And like Cypher, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now like everyone's doing it, even Jerry's doing it. After yeah. he told me, no, I'm not well, going to learn shield dropping. That's too hard. You know what? And I was like, dude, now just I'm, do this. Now, now I'm going to stop shield dro dropping. <laughs> It'll be the new meta. <laughs> the new meta, don't shield drop. <laughs> yeah. Everyone thinks you're going to shield drop. You just like sit there on shield and you yeah. just like jump. It'll be a total know? mind And they'll be like, what? You're supposed to like... She'll drop attack me. Yeah. What are you doing? That's, that's when you totally bamboozle them by just waiting there. Marth on the ledge, sort of, sort of hard to get out. Um, <laughs> invincibility mind games, my favorite kind of mind game. <laughs> oh man, the walk up, the walk up jab, the walk right up, in his face. do the worst option <laughs> in terms of like, for, in terms of like on his. On shield the frame advantage? The like only thing that could have been worse was a taunt in his face. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been even. That would have been pretty sweet. <laughs> but it was bold. It was quite bold. <laughs> bold move cut. <laughs> Let's see if it pays off. It definitely won't. Oh my. Ooh. Wait, so who? Wait, who's more? Plank, plank, plank. Or hat, hat, hat. Yeah. Uh, uh, so uh, th that was actually a um, point that I was trying to make is that uh, Hat before told me that he was playing versus uh, a Mara, right, on this stage. Right. And every time he would just go towards the platform when he was recovering. And every single time he would get tippered. Right? So, like, at some point he was like, wait a minute, why am I landing on the platform versus Mara? Yeah. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> well. I suppose you have no choice unless you can fall through on your way down. Well, and so, yeah, but like, so in that situation, it's like, oh my gosh, gets Randall. Gets yeah. Randall and just jumps at him and dies. Um, like, Plank had the option to just land on stage, and Marth actually has to, like, space a tipper much harder on landing on the stage. Like, he has yeah. to, in a split second, figure out where she is and maneuver himself in such a position where he can tip her. Yeah, and yeah. if he can't do that, then it's like, you get weak F smash, and that's just not good. Yeah. But or not great, right? But yeah, yeah. yeah, so like Plank lands on a platform, you get this giant arc to deal with. It's like, you know. It's true. So we'll see where the counter pick war goes here. Um, I, I never know how serious game they're. Four? Game four? He's forfeiting FD. Wow. Dang. Uh, that's a bold strategy. Okay, so this <laughs> is. Let's see if off. <laughs> So this, this is this is the this is like this is like Chu SDing against Hungrybox. Oh no, that was that was legit. I actually think he should have done it earlier because he needed the opportunity to get him with a wobble and then get a percent. Oh yeah. But he did it. So he did it kind of late. Yeah. yeah. He was so lying he around. He needed to do it before. Yeah. Um. So. So. Uh, um. So I'll give you a bit of reasoning behind why. <laughs> I'll give you a bit of reasoning why. Uh, why Hat might do this. Um. He has some issues with uh, with tilting, and so tilting like in, like you mean mentally or mentally oh, okay. tilting. And so I think they both do. yeah, so like so, I think what's happened before is that like uh, maybe like someone picks someone to like Pokemon Stadium, like like Hat gets picked to Pokemon Stadium. He's already like on the cusp of losing it, and he feels like if he loses. Pokemon Stadium, and he already thinks that matchup is garbage, right? Fox Sheik on Stadium, right? He thinks that if he loses on Stadium, he will not only lose the game, but also lose mental composure. Dang. As opposed so to being down another game for free, he's not even trying. Right. Like so, he thinks he'll be able to better, better win over two stages, including a counter pick, but that isn't. Something that will like set him off on a tilt and yeah. rampage, right? Yeah, yeah. So if you think about it that way, like, okay, it makes sense, right? I mean, I, I don't know. Obviously, it means he has to beat Plank. Yeah, that's uh. 
That's like choosing like legendary on some game like right off the bat. Just like you know what? I feel like making this really difficult for myself. <laughs> Choosing legendary and then like on the third stage you decide uh pistol zone. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Sick ops attack by hat, but he actually could have reacted to Plank not taking the ledge by taking the ledge himself. Dang. And so and so these are these are things where like as you get better you have to sort of recognize when you have to recognize three opportunities, I think is like uh Maybe the easiest way to get better in this game is like recognizing three opportunities and also having a good punish game. That's why. That's why. That's why. Freaking what is it? Um, ice climbers. That's why you see so many upsets by ice climbers. It's like you simplify the game and you can concentrate on getting your opportunities. Yeah. Cause I always thought that was kind of like a big key for like the longest time for like the gods, like. A part yeah. of what, like, what part of it, wait, what, like, separated them from people that were, like, kind of right behind them is that their punish game was just so good. Yeah, they could just yeah. seize an opportunity and, like, not let it go. Nice on the deck. Actually, say, oh my gosh. Should have shield dropped. He's still alive. Oh my gosh. A quick dip down. That was actually, like, almost super crucial. Like, if Hat had lived and then gotten a chain grab, this game would be like super close right now, but right. instead he's down a full stock. I don't know if it's been different lately, but I always feel like this is a Hat struggle to get a combo. Historic yeah, I think. Ooh. I mean, maybe it's different from recently. No, I think recently it's actually been the case that Mike has just sort of been like beating them up in cheek dittos. Because yeah. I feel like that's what used to be the case. Who knows, maybe one day Hat will like pick Fox or something, he'll like see the light. Oh my gosh, it should have just been a space animal man this entire time. <laughs> just like you should have gone Falcon. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh, wait, this is. Come back. Oh. oh. Oh, and that'll do it. Good set. And we got grand finals. Plank Dang. versus Jerry. Dang. The way it was meant to be. <laughs> the, <laughs> the way it was prophesied. Indeed. By the ancient 